the situation in northeast Nigeria is without question a difficult one. And I, I think realistically uh, there will be significant numbers of people, uh, registered voters, who will not be able to cast their ballot because of the disruption caused by Boko Haram. But just as we have seen recently in Ukraine, um, it is possible still to conduct elections and to find ways to ensure that as many people as possible are allowed and able to, to vote in those elections. Uh, I think the situations are somewhat similar in uh, Ukraine to northern Nigeria. Similarly, uh, the situation in Afghanistan, we, we, where USIP was very much involved in the preparation for those elections and in combating the, the uh, factors, the drivers of violence. Um, the fact that uh, a war was being conducted there did not prevent elections to be, uh, being held. So that is essentially what we were also looking for in Nigeria is an effort on the part of the organizers of the elections to do everything in their power, everything possible to enfranchise as many of those people in the Northeast as possible.